So, Windswept Heath. I wonder if that means I'm up against some kind of collected company deck. I guess there could be could be a wide range of decks that play turn one Windswept Heath. Hmm, that's not what I expected. Discard Lightning Bolt and Blasphemous Act. I'm guessing this is like a Boros Reckoner, True Fire Captain combo deck type thing. Oh. Well, that changes the equation. Yeah, this is bad. Blood Moon is really good against this Sultai deck. <laughs> All right, well, that's cool. Let's see what we're working with. Yep, Blasphemous Axe, that's nine mana. All right, Volcano Hellion. Volcano Hellion has Echo X, where X is your life total and enters the battlefield, deals in a mana damage of your choice to you and target creature. Well then. Okay. Ten hornets. Oh, no, not the not the ah! Ooh. Ah! Oh, my eyes! Ah! But that was a fascinating game and a cool deck for my opponent. I won't get caught by Blood Moon the same way twice. Oh my god, are you kidding me? So my opponent will name Verdant, Verdant Catacombs and then the fetch anymore. So Spyglass into Blood Moon would be pretty annoying against this hand that I have. No, it goes with Creeping Tar Pit. Either they overlooked that play or are not holding Blood Moon. Yep, so there's the Boros Reckoner. I can kill that with Fatal Push, which I will do. And it's Liliana against whatever my opponent can muster. Another Boros Reckoner. I'll probably have to cash in Liliana to kill that. Okay, so here's the combo. Make as many hornets as you would like. 14 hornets. Alright, one and one. I'll be back for round three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two,